So we're upstairs in the dormitory area, so we live on the third and fourth floor. I'd like to just show you, when I came back to, when I came to seminary in 2012, um, this is what a typical seminarian room looks like at St. Mary's Seminary. So you kind of get this uh, little tiny room with a bed and a, a dresser, um, one bookshelf, um, and then you got a small little closet here and, and a sink. And this is pretty much it. So the rest of the furniture is all mine that I kind of added. And what's kind of funny about seminarians is uh, people keep adding stuff to their collection and when we leave we we give it away so uh, that's kind of the cool thing is I'll give all this stuff away I really won't take a lot of it home but um, so back 2012 this was my room and I'll show you and after you're here for about four years when you get into second theology um, they give you a second room and you get to kind of I made it into a sitting room each guy gets a little bit more creative so let me show you that we'll come right in here and uh, you kind of see I I took a little bit of a different approach so really um, we come here, uh, I come here every night and I do a lot of my schoolwork here at my desk and I have this uh, comfortable chair and I spend a lot of time prayer in here and then I also, um, a lot of guys will come and hang out here. Uh, it won't be uncommon for a random guy just to come in my room and be like, hey, what's up? And hang out, we'll, we'll watch TV and, and, uh, and just have fun. Um, something I, I left out earlier that I wanted to, to mention was, uh, you can see I've, I've, got, I've collected a lot of books. Um, and it's a little cluttered because I'm actually moving out here in, a, uh, in about a month, so you can understand things are starting to be shifted around. But before I came to seminary, I did not like to read. And that was one thing that kind of changed me. Um, it, being in seminary and all the reading they have you do, I really have found a new joy in, in, in the books that, uh, the knowledge that people are sharing with us and the books that they've written. So I've got quite a collection, and I look forward to continuing to read after seminary. Um, and I'd like to just say this. It, it's going to be tough to leave here, St. Mary's Seminary in Baltimore. I've been here for seven years, and I've really enjoyed my time. I've grown a lot. I've made a lot of great friendships that are going to last forever. But I am so very look, much looking forward to coming home, to serving the Diocese of Syracuse and uh, serving the people of God up there. So I can't wait for this new transition in my life and to be ordained a priest in the near future. Thank you, and God bless.